To satisfy the code, there must be an open head joint or some type of device no more than 33 inches on center. So you'll notice that's what we have here, four brick. Sometimes a designer will call for them to be much closer, 16 inch increments or maybe two foot increments. If you decide that you don't want to see an open head joint, and uh, I'd like to say I really prefer open head joints. They have a better opportunity of getting the water out of the wall if it makes its way in. But many times, just for aesthetics, there are different devices that can be placed in that weep hole. They're called cell vents. They come in various colors that complement the mortar. So once you insert them into that open head joint, it's almost as if that open head joint goes away. You don't notice it so much. Rope wicks are sometimes used, but obviously the small amount of square inches that you would have in using this device, it would be wise, and it's our suggestion, the brick industries, that you should put one of these every 16 inches. So every two brick if you're going to use rope wicks. But it just lays in the base of the cavity and uh, works like a wick might have in an old kerosene lamp to get the water from behind the wall.